So we're in this place, it's the Islamic Museum of Art, and uh, there's a coffee exhibit, as you can see on the floor. We have all these kinds of coffee, coffee stuff. Super scientific one. Simple cups. <laughs> festival but this is like the Brazilian part so I guess they're just like Brazilian singers Magnolia trees. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I see that. Look at that. It's so weird. It looks like a like a sabra fruit mixed with I don't know. It's like fuzzy. All right, so we're going to do an Ethiopian coffee ceremony because the, uh, coffee originated in Ethiopia. It's really cool here. They have like the bread over there, and that like usually Ethiopians don't have gluten in their bread because they make it out of teff. But these specifically are made of um, wheat. So yeah, <laughs> can't have it. But yeah, whatever. It's really cool actually. She's giving out the coffee. Got the coffee over here. It's actually really good part of Ethiopian, Ethiopian culture to eat with your family. No such thing as eating by yourself. Okay, so right now we're walking to the Jerusalem Theater for some Jerusalem music throughout the ages thing. But, like, look at the sky for a second, right? You would think, oh yeah, it's not raining. No, it's raining. It's literally raining on us. And they're like these tiny droplets that we can feel because they're cold to our skin. But there's like no clouds. It's so weird. Freaking global warming. <laughs> messing up. Messing it up. I always like this place. Nice chill place. There's like a bar over here and coffee shop and like another shop with like games and stuff. But it says it'll open soon. I guess they emptied it out to renovate, and you know, it's like, stuff. It's like being in theater. Theaters are cool. The nice steps, you know? Makes it feel like super fancy and whatever. All right, so it's Saturday night, and I ate a ton. I couldn't record anything, obviously, because I'm religious, but whatever. Anyway, uh, I just wanted to, I am working on some new stuff, some uh, draft league stuff. So, that hopefully will be coming soon. Um, I am in somebody's front office, so I'm not actually going to be playing, but I will be doing some team building, so be excited for that. Oh, yeah, so we're at the first station, and they have like concerts here sometimes. There's like a ton of stands, and my sister's ordering rebar. And they're seeing Hotel California out of all things, which is pretty funny. When you're so skilled at smuggling things into the movie theater, I have like a whole freaking 1.5 liter water bottle on my side. Oh, it's a Pikachu! Yeah, some tea, some tea. All right, so currently we are in the city of David, okay? We got like all these shops and stuff. City of David gift shop, sukkah, and this amazing view. Sorry about the wind, but... So right now we're going on a tunnel tour, which is like water tunnels beneath they hear some archaeological stuff. There's some tunnels beneath the, the city. Those are some of the water tunnels, which people also used to escape during the time of the Second Temple. Amazing view right here. But yeah, we haven't been there since like 2011. There's uh, the city of the um, 
Mount, Mount, Mount of Olives, where all the, uh, the graves are. People. Yeah, and this is what we do on Pentecost, which is what the English version of Sukkot is. We live in this thing, which teaches us that uh, we should appreciate our houses. So the whole point is that we live in these little things of wood that we make for a week, and then we go back to our home and we appreciate what we have. So, yeah, see you in the cave. Crouching down. I don't know if you can hear me, but there's like kids in front of me and they're crying. Oh my god. Say hi. Oh, yeah, that was it's, not that it's not that cold. You get used to it actually. Yeah, you get used to it. It's fine. Yeah, we've been to like Ismayano in the north. Oh my god, it's freezing here. Lower again. Ew. Oh, now we gotta crouch. POP! It's actually really fun. We're, we're all just walking to single file. Right? Imagine that they have to this is so fun. Yeah, they, they literally carved this in the ground. Look, it's like from here to here. It's day three of me walking in this cave. I don't know. I haven't seen anything alive except the people in front of me and the people in the back of me. It's like slime on the walls, some water. I took a sip, but I don't know. Kind of sus. If I don't make it, tell my family I love them. Day seven. I haven't had anything to eat. My knees and back are killing me. And the wailing of these kids won't end. It's day 20. We made it. It's over. Finally. I'm alive. Loki, that was really fun. Except for the fact that like we were in front of people who were screaming the whole time. Look at that. Super nice. I feel like I'm Link. I'm just coming out of the tunnel in uh, Breath of the Wild. All right, so we're about to do some VR tour here. Not sure how it's gonna work, but here's the VR headset. Pretty cool. And here's our map. I don't know exactly how I'm gonna know where I'm supposed to go, but we'll figure it out. All right, so basically, we're over here now, and this is by the the Kotel, or the Western Wall, is right here. So you can see, it's right over there. So we're like over here in like this cool garden place. So we're gonna go over there, do number two, and then follow this map to number three and four. And then use this fanny pack with my virtual reality thing to do the cute little things. Okay, so now we're on these steps, and they're specifically one small step, and then one big step, and then one small step, and then one big step. Because when you're going up, you see these one, two, three openings? There are three openings over there? Whatever, those used to be um, openings to the temple, right? So, therefore, you have these steps, and it's, it's kind of hard to go up these steps really fast. So, 
purposely did it that way. So you have to like do it slowly and think when you're going to the holiest place on earth. And we have all these ruins from the south wall. It's also like gates over there. But uh, yeah, all these cool pillars and stuff. Great view also, amazing view. Mount Olives, uh, City of David's like down there where we were before. And then like Harat Sophim, Mount Scopus is over there. And right, right there, sorry, right there is uh, the Al-Aqsa Mosque, or the Grey Dome. And that, if you know, Jerusalem is the main mosque of the Muslims. And then only after it is the Golden Dome. So, let's see if I can get a view.